rotor tillers and motherfucking, you know, uh, saber saw and motherfucking um, jigsaw, table saw, um, uh, shit, what, what else, what else, what else? I got a miter cutter, um, shit, nigga. I got a blower, shit, uh, you know, I got a yard front and back, so I got to have me, I got a front loading motherfucking, um, McLean motherfucking, uh, 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 lawnmower, um, shit, hell yeah, nigga, Troy built motherfucking this and that, I, that's my shit, you know, Home Depot, Lowe's and all that shit, y'all remember when I was getting shit done to my house, I'm gonna get some more shit done to my house, I'm gonna take y'all with me, they gonna put a pool in, motherfucking this, 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 y'all, I'm gonna take y'all with me, but when, 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 when it come down to getting shit done to my house, nigga, only thing I'm afraid of is heights, but I'm gonna be dictating the whole motherfucking way, I was all outside while they was putting the shit, do you need a nail gun? Oh, well, let me go get my compressor so I can cut that motherfucker on. Yeah, I was all in the way. They was like, if this bitch don't go in the house. See, the only thing is was fucking them up and was, was giving them gravy was the fact that I was afraid of heights. And I couldn't get on that motherfucking ladder. But trust and believe, if I could got on that motherfucking ladder, nigga, I'm all in the way. Okay, those are, okay. Okay, um, we need three and a half inch roofing nails. Them, them don't look right. Uh, we need, uh, yeah, we need a, 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 a nail gun because going up here with a hammer, nigga, you be up here all day long. I was all in the motherfucking way. I brought my air compressor from the back. Now, I got two different air compressors. I got an electric and I got a motherfucking one that take gas, nigga, don't fuck with me. Um, I brought my air compressor, my motherfucking, and I also got a handheld nailer. That's for the in, in, in the house, though, but it's like a handheld, like a, like a mitt. And you put that motherfucker on and pop, pop, pop. You, you follow me? To where you don't have to, now like my, 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 uh, my, my roofing nailer. I have a roofing nail gun that, you know, that I use with my air compressor. But that right there, I just bought one because I was like, you know what? As a homeowner, some shit crack off, nigga. I got all kinds of shit that's weapons in this motherfucker. I'm gonna do something to your ass real cold-blooded, I promise you. I got too much motherfucking shit up in here to get my ass whooped in my own goddamn house. Fuck that, okay? Because every motherfucking, oh, check this out, shit. Nigga, come in this motherfucker if you want to, shit. I'm gonna barbecue your motherfucking ass. You check this right here? Now, this goes to my, um, I got a, um, uh, listen. I got a motherfucking upright smoker, okay? Bad as fuck. Upright smoker. I got a, uh, one of them long, old school ass with the, with the drums that the niggas was selling in Compton back in the day where they just take one of them big ass, uh, barrels. Cut that motherfucker, cut that motherfucking half, weld some hinges and shit on it. One of them old ones from back in the day. Yeah. Um, because electric, uh, electric, uh, somebody finna get mad, but I don't give a damn. The electric barbecuers, niggas don't really body them. I do have one, but niggas don't really body them. We really don't body them. I'm gonna tell you why. Because that shit is for steaks and shish kebabs and shit. Like, nigga, we want some brisket on that motherfucker with some... Nigga, is, is that Kingsford? Yeah, we need we need the kind with the coals, with the motherfucking charcoal that turn gray. And a lot of motherfuckers that do be barbecuing, they don't realize that you have to wait until the charcoal get gray. You can't go out there, new coons, that don't know how to motherfucking barbecue. Go out there and put your meat and shit on the pit and the coals ain't turned gray yet. Your shit ain't gonna cook right, okay? Now... We did on the motherfucking barbecue stand. Shout out to the barbecue stand in Carson. Don't play, okay? I didn't get this way through osmosis, okay? So, but anyway, when, when you set, get your, your grill and shit all set up and it's hot, you take this motherfucker right here and this what cleans your grill. You don't have to take the grid off and bring that motherfucker in the house and wash it and all that other kind of shit. I know, I know that it's probably... You know, motherfuckers like, you don't put no water on it? Nah, bitch, that's called fire. And it will kill every motherfucking thing that's breathing and moving. Trust me. Now, when you take this heavy-ass wire brush right here, that's what I'm saying. Motherfucker come in my house clowning. If you want to, nigga, I'm going to fuck your ass up with this motherfucker right here. I got all kind of shit to kick ass with. It's kick-ass eligible in this motherfucking house right here. I promise you. Nigga, I'm going to tattoo your ass. You come in this motherfucking door talking about money of your life. What? Oh, okay, nigga, not today. Oh, you want to come in this motherfucker? Yeah, I'm, I'm clowning. From the start, you come in this motherfucker if you want to. As soon as you come in this motherfucker, and I got something in my goddamn room, nigga, that'll lay a nigga out. 
It's called DNR. Do not resuscitate. I got some shit in my motherfucking room, right? I wish a motherfucker would. And, 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 and the way I feel about my kids, too, nigga, shit. You better have a rosary in your motherfucking pocket fucking with me. That's all the fuck I'm going to say. You better have a motherfucker. Let's stay in your ground law in my motherfucking house. It's all that. Okay, um, that's all the fuck I'm gonna say. You better have some shit on you that's gonna stop me from getting your ass. Cause you come in this motherfucker right here, them double doors there. Nigga, them double doors right there, what shit will have you coming out of them motherfuckers with a sheet on top of your ass. I promise you that one. Now, let's get back on this motherfucking pressure cooker here. Pressure cooker. Uh, Cooks Essentials, QVC. You get that motherfucker on Easy Pay. You put your greens in there. It takes greens about. If you put your meat in there, you could always like to put your meat in, in your greens first because that's what's going to give you the bomb ass pot liquor. Pot liquor is, you know, the drippings and the sauce and the juice from whatever it is you're cooking. Some motherfuckers might want to call it a roux, whatever, however way you roll with it, or whatever term you give it. But when you're cooking good, good ass greens, the, the, the key to cooking good ass greens is what kind of meat you're going to put in it. Now, of course, smoked meat is going to give you a bomb ass taste. Now, I understand everybody ain't on no pork shit, nigga. I ain't no motherfucker. I ain't uh, CHF. I ain't none of that shit, nigga. It's called give me the fattest motherfucker. Okay, nah, that ain't fat enough. Give me that one. Turn that over. Okay, yeah, give me that one. I'm that motherfucker at the butcher. You understand me? I'm on some old nigga. Uh, look, check this out. Give me that fat motherfucker right there. Yeah. That's me. I just way I could. Now, Kitty, he do, you know, diabetes and shit running his hood. So, you know, I do kind of be mindful of that shit. But, you know, uh, but everybody else in my household. Now, Tony, he might be borderline on high, on high blood pressure a little bit because he's starting to get headaches that he never used to have. And see, when I met first met Tony, he was wearing size 36. And I was like, oh, okay. That nigga now, oh, my God, that nigga got even numbers. That's all the fuck I'm going to say. That nigga got even numbers. You hear me? He was a 36 from the beginning, but now, nigga, uh, all right. So, anyway, let me, uh, uh, get me a knife and get me some potatoes, because I've got to have this on this evening. I've got to have me some motherfucking, uh, what you call it? Yes, I do. I've got to have me some smoked potatoes on today. Shit. Just a couple. I don't need a whole lot. Just, uh, give me one. I got one right there. Shit, give me three. Three is cool. That's real good and proper just for me, shit. I was gonna make me a little bomb ass bacon sandwich, you know what I'm saying, and do do one of them, but you know, I kinda opted out of that, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna use the rest of that bacon to go with my other pack to make this here uh proper ass well uh what you call on tonight. So that's what's happening on that shit. Here we go. <clears throat> Need a little old bag. But yeah, family, I had a good ass when I tell you I had a good motherfucking weekend. Oh, Lord have mercy. Those of you guys that are on my Instagram and my motherfucking Facebook and all that, Instagram is under my goddamn name that you see on top of this motherfucking video. It's called One Sexy Tina. I'm just going to ask that you go ahead and check it on out. I ain't going to even disclose on all that because motherfuckers going to think I'm bragging and I'm trying to, you know, uh, crip walk on another motherfucker and that ain't my thing, you know what I'm saying? Because he give it, then he take it away. Okay, so then therefore I'm just gonna leave it right there. Okay, but when I tell you that I had a good ass motherfucking weekend, baby, I had a good ass fucking weekend. Started it off, me and my baby, we went to the uh, jazz festival, had a bomb ass time. My auntie and all them was going, but my auntie had, you know, went in the hospital Friday night. Uh, she all right now, you know what I'm saying? But auntie back on talking shit. Do you understand me? So auntie cool, but you know she's asthmatic and she just just became asthmatic. I said, damn, nigga, you waited till you get down now. Nigga, you half a century, motherfucker, and you now getting asthma, nigga. What's going on? Is that some secondhand smoke type of shit, nigga? Cause I'm like, shit, nigga. What happens at fifty? Uh, look, damn, shit. Well, needless to say, my auntie has asthma. And it's freaking her the fuck out. She like, shit, I ain't never been able to, to not be able to breathe, nigga. The shit you take for granted nowadays. I said, damn. I said, auntie, don't tell me that shit. Don't tell me that shit that it's, uh, 
Later on in life, your breathing and shit get compromised. Shit, nigga, I, you know what I'm saying? Can't even go down on the motherfucker right because I need my nostrils. You know what I'm saying? I got to get some air. You know what I'm saying? It's called even exchange of oxygen. You know? So then, therefore, while you handling this right here, you sliding on the cob, whatever your get down is, however you roll. I need this shit right here to be able to still work. So, nigga, if you clogged up and you can't, nigga, no, nah, nigga. It's called albuterol, Adamar, all the motherfuckers, nigga. Uh, run me shit, nigga. Uh, can I get a TV test? I need you to make sure all my shit is paid. You know what I'm saying? Everything over. I can't be going out like that. I don't know. I don't, I don't know about not being able to breathe. Father, Father, I thank you. Mm, mm, mm. I thank you, Father. I do. I truly thank you. I thank you for everybody that is in my life. I got some cool motherfucking partners. Mm, mm, mm. Cool ass motherfucking partners in my life. Cool, cool, cool. I can't, I can't complain, you know. And people can say all you want, you know. People can say all kinds of shit, you know. But hell, nigga, I'm shit, nigga, I'm living shit. I don't even know what else to say or how else to call it. I'm living goddamn shit. But um, so we went to the jazz festival. But OJ's got down. Oh my God, the OJ's. Let me make love to you, baby. Ooh, hey, I won't hurt. Hey, I won't hurt. I treat you ever so gentle. Do, 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 do. Hey, them niggas was in step two. I was like, look at this old motherfucker. Nigga, I said, God damn, when you look at this motherfucker, this nigga right here. Oh, God damn. What I tell you? Because that nigga is old as the Noah's Ark. And I was like, this motherfucker right here, he was. When the morning comes, hey, me and Kim was jamming like a motherfucker. Shit, me and Kim, we was so fucked up. The words was, nigga, we was throwing all kind of shit. I said, nigga, don't that shit go to jingy shit, nigga. Because you throwing words in here that ain't got nothing to do with this shit, nigga. This shit was in the 70s and 80s. And you going to remix this shit with some millennium shit, nigga. Just hum, shit. We was so high, nigga. We was, woo! Mm, mm, mm. I had a good ass weekend when I tell you that I, nigga, look, Milky Way, Pluto, nigga, Mars, the moon, nigga, I was a space cadet, I'm telling you, I was high as a bat, I, look, I called Jan uh, Danella, me and Danella was texting yesterday, I had to take my medication, I was like, man, look, check this out, I'm in the moment, I had me a... Check this out. <coughs> yeah. That lets you know I don't really drink. But I had bought this right here to take with me. Little Parrot Bay. I remember a long time ago, Joey. That's called Pirate Bay. No, nigga. It's Parrot Bay, nigga. Parrot Bay. Okay. Um, Pina Colada. I had this. And I had two of these Island Squeeze. Uh, strawberry daiquiris. So I had one of these, and I didn't even open up these. So I had uh oh shit, I look real good at taking my bacon out. Don't take out my bacon and shit. Shout out to motherfucking Farmer John, maple bacon nigga make the best sandwiches in the world. You understand me? You talking about a BOT that'll make you bite your goddamn nails off, nigga? You can have stilettos, curves, motherfucking. You know, man and lady with the motherfucking palm tree in the back, nigga, you gonna bite all that shit off. Garnet with gold on the bottom of them motherfuckers, yeah. Uh, when you, uh, maple bacon, nigga, that shit comes straight from Shreveport. When, 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 I didn't know shit about maple bacon until I moved to Louisiana. I was in Louisiana for about, mm, We came back when I was pregnant with Anthony. So I wasn't even there a year. I was there about maybe nine months. I, nigga, I was miserable than the motherfucker. I said, damn. These niggas are still wearing soul clothes around this motherfucker. Motherfuckers with old school ass Cadillacs and horns on the front of the motherfucker. I said, oh, no, nigga. If you don't get my ass back to California, these niggas got soul clothes and gold teeth. I was 
cool. I was like, oh my god, niggas with pinky rings and shit on, motherfucking. My name is Lynn and I, nigga, no, nigga. It's like, uh, get me on the 10, westbound. Because this right here, nigga, I was like, oh my god, am I in the Twilight Zone? What's going on? N niggas coming down the street. Oh, no, nigga. I was like, I'm cool, nigga. There's some porky shit down here. I'm cool. I mean, no disrespect to the niggas that's from Shreveport, Louisiana. I got family down there, my mom in law down there, my um, father in law retired from Barksdale Air Force Base. Shout out to the motherfucking Air Force, you know what I'm saying? My mom in law lived there, um, got a little doctorate degree, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna throw her name out there, but you know, little, she, you know, she's in the councilman and she's in all that other kind of stuff over Zeta Phi Beta sorority and all that old type of old shit. My father in law. He got my my mother-in-law graduated from Southern, and my father-in-law graduated from um, from um, Gremlin, and he got his master's degree and all that, and you know, so you know they educators, and they you know they you know got a little name down there, so I can't even you know fuck it up, you know what I'm saying? 